Getting to 90 days of NoFap is not easy because of many things. And today I'm not going to talk about the addiction related brain changes that indeed makes it much harder. But today we are simply going to look at this. Check this out. Okay, so no matter how you look at this, 90 days is quite a long time and all it takes for us to fail is just a short moment of weakness somewhere along the line of those 90 days. It can be just a flickering thought like, this is not so important anyway, or hey, everyone does it, or it can even be just a moment of forgetting that you are actually rebooting now. Yes, indeed, all it takes is just one second of weakness. And here's the deal. During your 90-day challenge, there is going to be 7,776,000 seconds. And if one second of weakness is all it takes, and you have 7.7 .7 million seconds, then Obviously, a 90-day challenge is not going to be easy. Now, there are a few people out there who have a strong internet presence. I'm not going to mention any names, but they would say something like, you have to stand guard at the door of your mind for every second of your journey. Yeah, so while that sounds quite heroic and all, it is not that good advice. It would, however, be a good way to drive yourself absolutely crazy. Why? Well, just look at the amount of seconds. You can not be on high alert examining every single thought you have during all those 7 million seconds. You can't do it. But what you can do is to remind yourself a couple of times every single day why this NoFap challenge is so important to you and also remind yourself of the fact that you are going to get attacked by urges at some point. You are going to get struck by a second of weakness and then plan what you are going to do when that happens. You do that in advance and then you also practice it in advance even when you are not having urges. Do this a couple of times a day and it will help you. And so now you say, but that sounds like a lot of work. <laughs> well, a bit of work, yes. But it is a heck of a lot easier than to stand guard at your mind's door for every single one of those 7.7 <laughs> million seconds. Listen, by preparing and going through it in your mind in advance, you are much more likely to be able to handle it when it happens for real later on. It also makes you much more aware and mindful so that you can more quickly notice what's going on then when those seconds of weakness attack you. Understand this, standing guard takes a lot of energy. But awareness simply means being present in the moment. And then if something happens, you will notice it much more quickly simply because you are present. The more aware you can be, the better. And you know what? A wonderful tool for increasing your awareness is not only to do the tips I just shared with you, but to also practice meditation. Yes, the more you meditate, the more mindful, present and aware you will become. And the more aware you become, the bigger the gap in time between a sudden trigger and your autopilot reacting mode will become as well. And that's really helpful to widen that gap. Alright, I hope you found this informative. And if you did, consider subscribing for more. And every one of you, listen up here. Turn the setting on that bell icon to receive all notifications as well. So that you don't miss out on any videos when I release them. And if you haven't already, make sure to download my free 90 day no PMO advice and tool guide using the link below. Now, this is not an online course or anything big like that. It's just an easy to read PDF file, almost like in, in bullet point form, sharing things that will happen to you during certain phases of your reboot and what can be good for you to consider during those 
faces. And oh hey guys, speaking of those addiction related brain changes, then you should know that understanding what's going on inside your brain if you're addicted to porn is going to be super helpful for you. So if you haven't already, please take a look at a video series I made about that just a few weeks ago. You can see that series on the screen right here. Just click on that and it'll take you there. This is Scandinavian Bob signing out for today. Keep going and keep being a dopamine focused warrior.